what's the right way to approach a snake? Um, uh, you see a snake, yeah. you run away, you are close to it, you're about to step on what's the, what's the best way of... Uh... I always say the safest snake is one that you leave alone. <laughs> <laughs> so, for example, you're walking and you come across a snake. The best thing you can do with a snake is to give it space. That's all a snake wants. Give it space. It, it doesn't matter if it's two meters, three meters, four meters. If you give a snake space, it will leave you alone. So just by looking at the snake, just stand still, allow it to do what it, it wants to do, it will, it will move away from you. Mm. Because snakes naturally fear predators. Anything bigger than a snake, a snake will fear you. Uh -huh. yeah. it, it, um, should I run away? No. No. Just stand, just stand still. still. Or if you can, just move slowly backwards. It will, it, it's not a problem. Yeah. Sna a snake will only bite someone who's actually confronting it. So let's say you see the snake and you carry on approaching it. It feels that this is a predator. It wants to attack me. Uh -huh. So I need to defend myself. That's how, how people get bitten. When, yeah. when you, you pick up a stick and you start beating exactly. it, it, will, it, 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 it literally has to, fights back. Yeah, snakes are very defensive animals they will fight back. That's how they are designed to be. So I've had a lot of cases where dogs get bitten by snakes. And people believe that the snake actually approaches the dog and bites the dog. No, it's not like that. <laughs> the dog is the one that at attacks the snake. And the snake is, I mean, the snake's natural instinct is to fight back. Mm. And it bites the dog. Mm. Yeah.